Well, as women, we often face scrutiny about the way we look, and sometimes we can be our own worst enemy. As Elise Coulter reports tonight, two swimsuit models considered plus size may help reshape the way we women see ourselves. I definitely compare myself probably on a daily basis. Samantha Jablinski loves shopping at Lorelai's Boutique in Centerville, but sometimes doesn't like how she looks in the clothes. I used to be like a size extra small, small, and now it's, you know, I you try to like squeeze into things and you know it doesn't look flattering. Jablinski struggles with her self-image every day like most women. But now, thanks to this plus-size model featured in the Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Edition and this ad also featured in the same edition, she has hope. More magazines should be doing this. I mean, it's absolutely what should be representative of what young girls should be looking up to. Dr. Bruce Klein, a clinical psychologist, agrees and believes this photo can be beneficial to young girls and their self-image. She's already toughened, if you will, hardened to that kind of criticism and scrutiny and so give her a lot of credit. I think that's a good model for young girls to look to. It's just awesome to be able to fit in the things. Kimberly King knows what it's like to be uncomfortable in your own skin. I just kept spiraling down. I kept gaining a few pounds every every year. She recently lost 40 pounds and says the photo of the plus size model is great, but she has one issue. I've read that they think she's a size 14 mm -hmm. and to me, that's not that's not a plus size in my opinion. The King thinks it's still a step in the right direction. Girls need role models that are of a normal size. Reporting in Centerville, Elise Coulter, Fox 45 News. Well, as Jack says, all women are beautiful. Are. Dr. Klein says there can also be a negative effect on kids if a girl's parent is critical of a model and doesn't believe she should be featured. That can have negative consequences on the child's self-image, especially if the girl already feels bad about herself. Well, as you can imagine, the story is getting plenty of attention on our Facebook page, and that's where Deb writes, I think it's about time that they show women that represents the real women of the world. And Sarah says, I don't think labeling her as plus size is very helpful to girls with body image issues. Let us know what you think. Head to Facebook.com slash Fox 45 Dayton. We'd love to hear from you.